you guys decided who's going first? MC. <laughs> MC's going first. Seven jokes each. Let's rose! Go! Uh, broken mic stand. I wanted to expect uh, anything better from this show. <laughs> oh! I only agree to do this because on the list of unremarkable comics, nobody gives a fuck about in this city. Matt might be the only one more hated than me. <laughs> MC, MC's a stage name, his real name is Mike. MC is just his permanent position on any showcase he's booked on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, really, it really stands for Matt's a cunt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, baby, I love watching you two fight. That's cool. <laughs> Thank you for letting me into your house. It's been a good time. <laughs> Oh man, that is what happens when your parents don't make fun of you enough. He's unaware he has the face of skim milk, the body of porridge, and the personality of a lactose intolerant shit. MC is right, I'm a fucking cuckold to his relationship. MC is married, he has a wife, and she is much funnier than him. And I don't believe women are funny. <laughs> Christian and an Eagle Scout, and for someone who's such a gaping asshole, it's really a miracle he wasn't fucked by his pastor or his troop master. Oh! <laughs> Thank you for the setup. Oh, we like that, we like that. MC works in a hospital, but he's not a doctor, that's nice. It's because his face looks like his tumor and his personality is cancer. <laughs> You thrived with masks on. <laughs> I would pay money for the cover half of his face. <laughs> yeah, if you had any, that'd be great. Huh? Eighty two dollars from TikTok, right? Yep. <laughs> yeah, magic trailblazer for dipshit Midwest bros. Proving the face of date rape can also be autistic. <laughs> No one make eye contact with me, okay? <laughs> if someone brings a train whistle, then we're gonna have problems. <laughs> uh, man, I, grew up, I grew up in rural Iowa. I grew up poor in rural Iowa without a father, man. It was weird for me growing up because all three of my brothers and I worked as farmhands growing up since we were 13. Now, I'm from Southern Georgia where they don't have farmhands. They use a different term. I'll give you a hit. It starts with an S and ends with laves. <laughs> I, I'm not I'm not saying NC is racist. It just looks like every outfit he has he got from a skinhead outlet store. <laughs> Where's the white hoodie, MC? You forget it? <laughs> well, at least we have black people in Georgia, you know. Like Matt Matt actually might be the best thing to come out of Iowa, considering he's a skinny limp dick bitch. <laughs> Which probably says more about Iowa than anything else. <laughs> oh man, Lipstick Bitch is my drag name. <laughs> okay, okay, find me on Broadway after this. <laughs> you fucking freaks. MC is a disgraced drummer in the band. He was kicked from his band right before they went on tour. So he kept getting rim shots mixed up with rim jobs. <laughs> oh! Even more embarrassing, it was his high school band. <laughs> that poor director, you know? <laughs> the only thing more viral than Matt Delta variant band work and his shitty TikToks are the disgusting ass comics he dragged back and forth to Iowa during the pandemic. <laughs> like your host, Chris Greco, you're probably all gonna want to get tested. <laughs> it's true. Yeah, that's true, that's true. Yeah, MC just accused me of being a super spreader during the pandemic. That's uh, called being booked. <laughs> Dude, I did more in-person shows and more virtual shows, which is crazy, because you look like you would kill on the dark web. <laughs> Murders in men's rights forms. <laughs> That's the guy with the wife. <laughs> Last joke? Last one. Is it me? Yeah. 
Alright. Uh, Matt has the sex appeal of Steve from Blue's Clues. <laughs> he lives alone. His friends are imaginary, and the only people that want to fuck with him are kids on the other side of the screen. <laughs> Hold on. And his mother, which, to be fair, only wants to shove him up her cunt so nobody can hear a Snapple joke ever again. Here's a Snapple joke for you. Old Faithful blows every hour on the hour right up Matt's fucking asshole. <laughs> That's true. MC actually got married during the pandemic, but he has yet to have the actual wedding ceremony. She's holding off on it, which is crazy. Because in two months from now, when he gets divorced, she's gonna have to deal with zero percent of the embarrassment. And he got a botched vasectomy, which makes that even funnier. Uh, she's gonna get half of his money and both of his balls. <laughs> all right, that's all. Right. that this would just completely tank him up. <laughs> just so they would both shut the fuck up. <laughs> but I can't say that they did. That was one of the greatest roasts I've ever fucking seen on the show. Great job, guys. One more time for them. Back and forth. We're gonna end it with Joe. Are you still at the show? Are you attacking? You know, are you gonna stick around? I'm, I'm, I'm giving you some uh, uh, Instagram. Thank you. Uh, uh, okay. You and then Jackie after. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Um, uh, I gotta say, uh, that was an amazing roast. Both of you really brought it. Like, holy shit. Um, uh, I mean, MC insulted all the comics he brought to Iowa, which I was one of those. <laughs> There's four in the room tonight. <laughs> but also, on the show in Iowa, Matt brought me up as, you can see this guy on Reddit. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm Joe. A little, I'm a little confused, but uh, on this one. But honestly, I'm gonna have to go with Matt on this one. Oh. Oh. for Matt Taylor, everybody. You're one of the good subjects, Joe. Jackie. It was tough. You're both great, but um, as someone who is in love with Steve from Blue's Clues, I gotta give it to Matt. Oh. Oh. Two for bad words. The other Matt. <laughs> Uh, you know, this is the funniest I've ever seen the two of you be. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. Fueled by hatred. They wrote for, just to make it interesting, I'm going to give it to MC, because he did a good job, and I think he deserves a little bit of credit. Go for MC Lightsey! The owner of the Lincoln Lodge, John Ledley. Well, I think it was, uh, it was great roast. Uh, I don't know. MC's an IT guy, and Matt generally has the personality of an evil fucking computer from the 80s. <laughs> processing, processing, I'm mad. <laughs> Good ad <Adler. laughs> I'll, uh, I'll be honest, I loved everything Bandwick did, but uh, I got a cash register out there, and I know what uh, MC does. I'm going to give it to MC. <laughs> 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 Well, I think this is gonna come down to you guys. I don't know. I need to know if you guys are gonna fucking give it up for these guys, because they were voting for a fucking winner tonight, okay? Okay? So when I say it, no half-ass shits. We're voting for a winner. Are you choosing MC Lightsey? Woo! Or are you choosing that bad one? 